First off, we're going to need two circles. So place your fidget spinner near the bottom left of the page. Draw a circle using the bearings. Mark your center point and draw a line straight up. Then take the fidget spinner and to the right of the line straight up, draw a circle. And that circle should be on the edge of that line that is straight up and slightly to the right of the other. Next up, the top right circle is going to be for the head. I'm using the two circles as placeholders and sketching in lightly different features of Sonic's face. After I've got my rough of the eyes, I start drawing in some darker lines as well as the ear. So the ear is just two triangle shapes put together. His back, top of his porcupine wing spine goes almost to the back of the lower circle if you're to draw a line straight down. He has three large ones. Next up I'm going to draw his hand on some circles for placeholders and then darken in the lines for the details. Once you have the rough shape of the rest of his head, you can darken in the rest of the lines. Once you've drawn in his mouth, place the fidget spinner, and you could stop here, or what I've done is drawn in the rest of the body. The trick to the feet is drawing them around the first circle. That way when the fidget spinner is placed on top, it'll look like the feet are running kind of in line with the bearings. And the red shoes will pop with the red bearings. The next step is to place the fidget spinner on Sonic, make sure that everything looks good, and then darken in any light lines and color in Sonic.